Jeremy Watson is one of my best friends from high school and is a pole vaulter at Wittenberg University who has always had a knack for the sport. Starting back in seventh grade, he has accomplished many things in his years since, including being in the top eight for high school pole vaulters in Ohio, getting a scholarship to Wittenberg University, as well as getting the school record at Wittenberg University at 14 feet and one and three quarters inches. He has shown much grit and has shown what it takes to have perseverance through the pressure, pain, and injuries. I decided to interview him to ask him three simple questions. What was a goal that he has accomplished? What were some obstacles that might have deterred him from potentially getting the goal? And what his life is like now after getting that goal? This is what he had to say. Yeah. Okay, sweet. So like, so, so, so some, some goals like I had, like starting out was like, uh, in high school, I had this goal to be an all out athlete, which was like the top eight uh, athlete in your event uh, for track. And by my senior year of high school, I reached that when I like placed seventh at the Ohio track meet and, and got a career PR of 14 feet. That was a huge, huge goal that I hit. But uh, if I came to college to jump, to jump, and uh, and 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 the record here at Wittenberg, uh, I came in was four meters thirty centimeters, which is fourteen one and a quarter. Uh, I managed to beat that by one centimeter my uh, at, at my conference meet. So, so so that's a huge goal that I achieved. I now am the Wittenberg indoor football record holder. So. And then my overall goal to quit pole vault would be to jump 17-4. be a really nice goal to uh, end my uh, career on. Second question. Uh, what are what were some obstacles or struggles that you needed to come overcome? And uh, how did you how did you manage them? How were you able to get over them? Ooh. So so some struggles were like injuries, of course. Like my when it's my senior year, I uh, I broke my leg essentially at a track meet that stopped me from progressing uh, past past uh, May in track, which which sucks. But uh, that that was the challenge to come back to. I I couldn't vault for four months going going to my senior year, and then even here my freshman year of college at my first ever collegiate meet, I dislocated my shoulder at my very first jump. So I didn't compete until February of my college career, which, 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 which is what I've come to miss, like, in college. Like, I miss all but three meets. Um, so, and usually the biggest part. What were, like, some struggles coming up, like, potential heights that you weren't able to hit or, like, working on form or stuff like that? Like, what were some, what were some other potential struggles that you might have had? Oh, uh, definitely, definitely just like the weight of like being the best vulture here. It sounds funny, but, but like I came in here, the coaches and when I came in here had the mentality that I would like jump uh, these school records. So so from day one, like that that's what they trained me for is do that. But like mentally, it's 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 hard to mentally combat that when like all you hear is this one mark this one mark and then and then you don't hit it in, in the meet uh in your first meet and then and, and, and then you get stressed and then you go to the second meet and then you do worse and then so on and so forth that was a huge mental struggle was what was that one mark that i, I just kept hearing the entire first semester of college um and then another big one was like Force form. I'm going through it right now. Form, the big one. I, I I'm I'm in, in between phase where I'm transitioning from one way of vaulting to uh, to another uh quote unquote better way to vault. So it's like it, it's it's hard to like maintain the height that that I need to vault with with the change in form. If that makes sense. All right, um, and then finally you can now go into detail about, you know, what your life is like now that your goal has been achieved. Yeah, so so now it's not really nice that I achieved that goal because, because like, 
uh, next next fall, my my name's gonna be on that record board with like a bunch of great all American athletes, which is really cool. And now and now I surpass that. Every time I get put in in pole vault for an event, my uh my PR is gonna be four meters thirty one right now. So it's which is what is really respectable at the D three level. And it's it's just a cool thing to like put on like my resume is that like I hold the record at Wittenberg University for indoor pole vault.